hello there my fellow miners and crafters good times with star here and welcome back to the wonderful worlds of hermitsy crafting and at the moment we are in the in-between the in-between the overworld of hermitcraft that you know and the depths of the nether that we'll soon discover which is going to be amazing so this is the giant mine shaft that we hollowed out with the big drill and now we're just fallen fallen into the depths and hopefully we meet up with the b and the g and the upside down but we're going to make an amazing upside down neighborhood. But until then, I guess we're just going to continue to fall. Fall with style. Oh, we finally made it. This is not the nether I remember. Wow. Hello. I remember you, cute little fella. Um, oh, there's the drill. Hi, drill. <laughs> this is so cool. I am so glad that I waited to come to the nether in style this is amazing i don't even know what biome this is this must be where you get the black stone it is oh my new favorite block oh wow i love the tiered aspect of this place with the lava and the bernie blocks down below and the lava and the little bouncy mcbouncer friends oh i love this where else does this go how deep is this place <laughs> I love it. This is a, oh, hello. Oh, upside down. Hi, upside down. I'm glad my coordinates worked out. <laughs> I'm so glad. Wow. That is a, that's a big mansion right there. And then, I don't know what that is. And then, rules? <laughs> rules and a little house. I like that. Anyway, wow. I'm so glad to be in the nether, but it's so dark and foggy here. I can't see a thing. <laughs> Ow. Okay. Well, this is starting out good. Oh, we are going to need one of those fancy respawn anchors because it is a long ways from the overall back to our new home here in the ne nether. Hello? Who's that? Oh, wait. Wait, is that who I think it is? Ch Jelly, what are you doing here? <laughs> and why are you upside down? The last time I saw you, you were, you were struck by lightning. <laughs> and now you're upside down. Excuse me, sir. This is a reunion amongst a man and his cat. I will have you stay back. I don't want any more. Why? Why magma cube? Nobody better have saw that. Oh, one of those respawn anchors could really come in handy, as I said. <laughs> but Jelly, oh, you beautiful cat. You need to come away from here, Jelly. It's, it's, it's too dangerous. It's, there's too many scary things. Like, look at all those enchanted swords just waiting to cut us down. We need to start building up some infrastructure here because this place is terrifying. It has been a bit of a roller coaster since we came down here. <laughs> Let's try to keep our head on our shoulders, okay? I have noticed that the pigmen appear to have just one floppy ear. They didn't get two floppy ears in the update. OJ cut a corner there. <laughs> uh, let's see. So I found this board when we flew in here originally. The upside down rules for all citizens. Ooh, citizen rules. Uh, do not AFK. All new citizens must be pranked. Oh, come on, guys. I just got here. I, as I said, I barely have my head attached to me. Each new citizen can add one new rule. Okay. Hmm. All right. We're going to be on the lookout for pranks. <laughs> and uh, we need to come up with a rule now that I guess we're... Wow, you're right in my face. Um, now that we're a citizen. All right, then. Well, that sounds awesome. And as I said, this thing looks so eerie in the fog. Hey, look, Green's got chest monsters, too. We're not the only one. So I've been putting in a little bit of thought into what our rule could be for the upside down. And I think I may have got something. What if the idea is that all residents of the upside down are required to have an upside down pet at all times? Now, the key with this is that you must keep the pet alive in this treacherous environment and if you let the pet fall to its demise you will have to face serious consequences so yeah let me know what you think of that like i like it i think it's got a fun little uh, aspect to it that you have to keep the animal alive and things along those lines so with that we need to start building out a safe space for us here because this place is terrifying and we're gonna need a lot of infrastructure down here. And eventually we're gonna sell some of the resources that we get from the nether. And we're gonna need mining operations and things along those lines. So with that, we are going to need to bring down the drill deeper and create a much larger hole to bring down all of the supplies that we need to start building down here. And especially we are going to need the mechanized Scarex security forces. So that's 
That's like priority number one after the drill. Back here at drill command, and I'm ready to push this drill all the way down. So we have a nice big opening for our nether cards and our vehicle elevators and things like that. But while I was flying up here, I noticed that uh, Green left us a message here. Scar left you a respawn anchor at your nether base, dude. That's exactly what we need. I'm on my third death at this point. So I'm looking forward to seeing that. So let's activate that. And there we go. Also, we probably should let Grin know. Thank you. So that is what a respawn anchor looks like. That is really cool. Now, do we just click it? <laughs> there we go. It's as if we are a wizard looking at our future through our crystal ball. Oh, what in the world? Whoa, 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 whoa. Why am I on fire? Oh, no. Oh, no. Potion, 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 potion. Oh, no. We're taking a big bath. Oh, it's a hot bath. Oh, it burns. Oh, it stings. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, what? Okay. <laughs> Public surface announcement. Don't look from the screen when you're flying in the nether. Wow. Okay. I think we're safe. All right. Let's do what? <laughs> I was safe with the potion. How did I die? Ah, oh, I think I hit the tree. The nether is just too much for me. <gasps> oh, uh, pigs? Mean pigs? What the heck was that? <laughs> I have a feeling. Yep, I had a feeling that this is a trap and I'm pretty sure it's a trap. Oh, ho, ho, this can only be the work of the B and the G. <gasps> and there they are. They, they, they got some kind of control room over there. What? Guys, come on now. b dubs pushed me in. <laughs> he pushed me into the pig hole. <laughs> I didn't want to go into the pig hole. Yep, yep, another one. Another one. This is This is Groundhog Day. This is Groundhog Day, but with pigs. It's Pig Day, not starring Bill Murray, so it is not a funny movie. Yeah, yeah, give him a hug. I'm the one who needs a hug. Help! Help! It hurts so much! I'm gonna kill you with those big no, eyes! Not. I'm gonna poke those eyes! He's I'm gonna smash so them! I'm gonna smash them! <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, I thought when you said I stopped it, I, I would stop dying, but when I start dying again, no. <laughs> down again. Here, Green, let me flick the lever a couple times. Okay, okay, you can okay. Walk. Oh, this is okay, wonderful. Okay, okay. No, it's down not wonderful. Goes. No, I don't even know what these creatures are. Why do they have, mo <laughs> Why do they have mohawks? <laughs> and down it goes. <laughs> God, I'm so sorry. This is your initiation into the upside down. Oh, oh, oh my God, it burns. <laughs> it burns. Again. Again, down again. Goes. Down Get me out of here. Oh. <laughs> Dude, you don't know how long we've been waiting. This prank has been six hours in the making. No. Yay. No, no, no. No, 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 no. No, no, no. I get one glass don't block. Don't break the glass, Scar. Don't break it. That uh, again. When, when do you think enough is enough? I'm not sure. Hmm. I, could, I could give you guys something really nice. Ooh, well, presents. Yeah, really good presents. You just don't pull the lever when I respawn. Don't even. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> Grant, I wait for your for your command. Don't do it. No. No. <laughs> 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 it's instant. It's instant death. It's not even funny. It's just instant death. Where does oh. one get such a thing? Where does one get the idea, first of all? But where does one get a mohawked pig? Uh, okay, so the deal is... Oh, you box crap. me in with... with... That... No, Scott. Scott bad. Scott, Scott, Scott. Oh, oh, oh he's out. out. I'm out. I'm oh. out. <laughs> well, that was your initiation. The 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 rule. Have you read the rules of the upside down? I did. I really did. Well, I'm that trying was to remember rule number two. Were. All citizens must be pranked. Oh, I and did read that. That. Was, that was your initiation. Congratulations. <sighs> Do you know what the funniest thing is? We were literally we were mm -hmm. hiding behind this wall. Literally, like we were hiding behind this wall, and you we heard you activate the respawn anchor, and we were like. So what are the uh, what are the chances he dies within like the first minute? Is it not gonna happen? <laughs> We're gonna be waiting here a long time, dude. You died in like thirty seconds. Whoa. That was fantastic. I, I, I stopped recording and 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 I I, I flew out. Oh, what? Why is there? A... Oh, there's glass. Um, <laughs> yes. Okay, I'll just explain from here. I, I flew out and I looked at my phone and and I flew into one of those lava streams and and i hit the I, I was trying to get my potion and then i thought i was safe and then i flew away but i clipped a tree oh <laughs> i've died like five times b-dubs 
Oh, your face scares me added more than those pigs. Yeah, dude, the the <laughs> chat, the chat is insane. Oh no! <laughs> no. <laughs> oh! no, Scar, you don't know what you've done. <laughs> what? I don't want to oh, be God. in the loop. Scar, <laughs> no, no, we no. gotta get him. We gotta get him. We gotta get him. Oh, it's easy. Oh. Oh, what? <laughs> That's oh. done. He's back. Oh no, you don't! I already no. got initiated. <laughs> Who's already initiated? I blew up from a bed. Oh, uh, you you slept in the Nether? <laughs> yeah, well, he tricked me. <laughs> don't! No! I got my stuff. Let me out. <laughs> <laughs> Why am I, I double initiate? Why double initiate? <laughs> oh. oh no, we need to recharge the anchor. Uh oh. Oh no. <laughs> uh oh. Not good. Not good, Scar. Uh, B Dubs he, is in a different place now. He, oh he's no. He's back on Scott Island. You made it back then, B Dubs. He back. Yes, it was the longest trip. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you are officially. I, I hold on. I just like knight you either side. You are officially initiated into the upside down, and Ooh. that means the next person to come along, we all need to band together and then prank them. Although I'm not sure how we top this, and I'm definitely not spending another six hours on this. this is ridiculous. <laughs> no, maybe we just get some weapons and slice them up. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> Okay, I think I, I, I've had enough. The B and the G really know how to make a man feel welcome here in the Upside Down. And as they left, they gave me a present. A present to remember this day by making a glass floor in my starter base here. So I can relive every moment of death that I had by the Mohawk pigs. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to have dinner tonight and it's going to be wonderful we're going to have ham we're going to have bacon and other pig related product and it's going to be quite fantastic but i have a surprise for you guys and that is the drill it finally opened up a gigantic hole in the nether roof here look at how beautiful that looks so we have the blue looking up into the overworld and from the overworld looking down into what the whoa are you serious you guys have killed me so many times today. That thing is coming in handy now. <laughs> oh no. No, no, he's eating my he's eating my golden carrots and he's wearing my boots and my hat. Dude just straight up ate one of my golden carrots. I know he did. I saw it disappear. <gasps> he did. He's eating my carrots. That is a beyond insult. And he's wearing my wings. He is so enamored by the golden carrots. He doesn't even see me. <laughs> hey, bro. <laughs> Keep enjoying the golden carrots. I'm told. Hey, no, no, no fair. Not fair. Not fair. Not fair. <laughs> Got you. <laughs> Dang it. Dang it. Why can't we be friends? Why can't we build trees together and not war? Can you think of the, the wonders we would create together? He's coming at me again. <laughs> I'm going to have to kill you. I'm going to have to kill you to make you... <laughs> Wow. You are the worst. The worst, the worst, the worst. Absolutely the worst. Okay, we got this this time. Got him. You <laughs> I like punched the sky thinking there was a great success after dying three times to him. Well, that was an absolute nightmare, but look at how amazing the drill looks up in the fog there with the drill poking through it. Absolutely wonderful. <laughs> Eventually, we'll have the ScarX security down here to help us with all of that. But what we need more than building out all the other pieces of infrastructure like the nether carts and the conveyor belts, we need a home. And you know what? We built something quite a while ago now, and it's time to fire it up and send it on down to the nether. We have finally arrived. That is right. Big Bud is in the nether upside down and attached to the ceiling. <laughs> that looks absolutely silly, but amazing. And it was quite a challenge to build this over lava upside down. But I think we pretty much nailed the entire design. There are a few little corks here and there with building upside down that we still need to work out. But 
<laughs> this is what Big Bud dreamed of this whole time is being in the nether, drilling away. Absolutely love it. Now in the interior, we are pretty well set up and ready to go to start bringing our resources into the inventory bay here. I had to change out the ceiling above because that didn't uh, work being upside down, but really this area is untouched. Now, if we go downstairs instead of upstairs, we still need to get the furnace array set up here. And in the crew quarters, um, <laughs> I got something to omit. I uh, nearly placed down a bed. And at the last second, Big Brain Scar intervened and saved me and Big Bud. But with that and the drill, we are now established here in the upside down. And look at how cool that is. It just disappears into the fog of the void with the blue sky above. So when you're in the overworld, you see the, the red glow of the nether. And when you're here in the nether and you look up, you see the glow of the blue sky above, which is absolutely amazing. We'll start bringing down the infrastructure here, which will look fantastic and turn this into a scarx uh, dig site which is going to be absolutely amazing but until then we've got some business to do back at the shopping district and the town hall scar hello hello oh whoa oh my i now have a mayor voice oh my goodness it's echoey in there today oh it is did you know my approval rating is over 118 percent is it really? Mm -hmm. That's over a hundred. That's <clears throat> fantastic. <clears throat> okay. All right. <clears throat> oh, you know, I, oh, you know, for business, yeah. it's good to do the voice, but um, yeah. just for a casual chit chat amongst uh, friends, I'll turn yes. it off. Colleagues, colleagues, as it yes. were. Okay. Yes. Of just course. think of me as a colleague. That's it's fine. It's okay. Yes. That's yeah. Fine. Yeah. I mean, my 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 high esteemed mayor. Look at how high this chair is. It is really high, and I see you've made some additions as well. They're intimidation the, uh, spikes. Wow. Yeah, they're they're intimidating for sure. Mm -hmm. So I've been thinking about this. See, I have some greens down below here. And yeah? I was thinking about making a toilet right here. So it's like throne on throne. Would you leave the greens in here? I do not want greens staring at me while I'm taking a poop. OK, OK, true. He could just look right up and see. Yeah, that wouldn't be a good look. No. True. So I'm thinking about a hatch. I'm thinking about a hatch that'll drop me directly onto the toilet. Oh, you would drop down. OK, mm -hmm. yeah, that's a cool idea. And then just take care I of your business. It. This is why I have a hundred and what was it, twenty six percent approval rating. It's going up every second. People love these fascinating ideas you have now, for your throne. Oh, well, this well is thank you. Yep. Because of genius ideas like this, and you've, your, you've also. Oh, I'm your mayor, so, oh. so change. Put put that back on. Thank you. My old head face. Yep, please, please. Why? Because your current head gives me bad nightmares about what you would what you and green did to me earlier yes <laughs> it doesn't bring back those terrible terrible memories <laughs> okay <laughs> the pigs okay and the Surprise! no 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 okay no don't do that okay i won't i won't i won't, ah, I, won't. I feel so much better right now may i compliment you on this out here this Ooh, is I thank you glorious so do, beautiful do you like the diamond trees i love the trees i love the trees and the diamonds these are your personal diamonds i presume yes no, no. You use are, them for the... No? No, these are the shopping district diamonds. I mean, yes, could we have hired somebody to do this or used it for some kind of resource? But, you know, when people come through here, they feel as if they're in a place of prominence. Like a twinkle in the eye, but a twinkle of a diamond in a tree. That's logic yeah. for some people. But do you, have you gotten any... Your approval rating still this high? Yeah. After it's, you did um, this? 132. 132. Going up again. Wow. Yeah. Fantastic. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. I per okay. Personally, I I feel like this could be <laughs> you could have used this in other ways to give to the people. Do you think Maybe. that I should have put more diamonds like Christmas lights on the outside of the town hall? Dude, that's no. what we're gonna do for Christmas. Oh my god, that's what we're gonna do for uh, Christmas. But uh most people use Christmas lights, not Christmas money. <laughs> So the money that we would have spent for presents for the hermits, we were just going to decorate the town hall with diamonds. You just all douse the town hall in diamonds? Oh, oh. Okay. here's an idea. Listen. We'll hire Cleo to do it. And then it's like, you know, giving some diamonds back, but also oh, making a shiny. That might put her in a bad spot. 
No, we're just going to push off all the blame onto her. We'll say it's her idea. Th we might be thinking a little backwards. As your campaign captain, I think it's good to use the diamonds to invest into the community uh, and not necessarily invest into your image. Here's an idea. I'm going to I'm going to I'm going to I'm going to meet you halfway. 50 50 vanity 50 for uh, others. OK, 50 50 50 that 50. could be your your slogan. Well, 50 percent help you and 50 percent help me. That honestly, I think that's better than most politicians. And this B-dubs is where the hermits go to get their road access pass. Now, I Ooh. am a bit of a stickler for payments and they're required to put their diamond block on the little pedestal there. So with this sort of stuff, um, you're having some people that maybe maybe are getting access and in, uh, road access. If that happens and somebody's kind of breaking the law, do you have any plans for handling that? Well, I don't want to tarnish my image. I'll tell you that mm -hmm. right now. So we need someone right. else to tarnish our own images. So I was thinking for the jobs board, we hire mm -hmm. an enforcer. So we can pawn off all the negativity onto them and people will know oh. us as the positive guys who decorated the town hall in Christmas lights made of diamonds. So I was thinking That's on the jobs board here, we just put like enforcer needed. That's a great idea. And we have a spare okay. office too, so it's a win-win. Oh, speaking of offices, have you seen mine? My nope. office yet? Nope. You haven't? Ooh, come with me, I'll show you. Ooh, you need to change that sign. I promoted you, remember? What am I now? You are the captain of the mayor. Captain of the mayor. Mm -hmm. What captain over the mayor? No, maybe. under the no. mayor. No, over captain the mayor? around the under mayor. the mayor. Cup Let's just go with of for the moment. You're really confusing with titles. I I have a hard time. It's working out though. I'm feeling real. You make me feel really great about myself. Here's my office. This, yes, and look yes. at the little tiny chair. It's so cute. It, well, I mean, it's not super tiny. It's, it's so it's, small. It's it's a decent size. Oh, uh, and, it's and, perfect and size for, for you. Because of what? Uh, you know, it's the size of the room. Yeah. Because I'm tall? Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Of course. Mm -hmm. It's a tall man's chair. Big man's chair. That's, that's right. Yeah, look at me and down so, here. Look at me. Yes, that's right. <laughs> oh, so, no, no. What? That's my bust. No. Hey, <laughs> why did you do it's that? Still, All right, I'll put this one on then. It's still looking at me. <laughs> I just it's see spinning. pigs with mohawks torturing me <laughs> over and over. And you in that little <laughs> control room with, with G. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> Well, I like it. I like I that's like the bus. little chair in the bus. It's very that, nice. So that's my office. And by the way, I use my own diamonds. I didn't use company diamonds for that or server diamonds. Did you hear the good news? What's the good news? Approval ratings up to 152. Already? Oh, wow. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. How are you getting this approval rating? Is it, somebody taking these statistics for you? Yeah, Jelly is. Oh, gel these are coming from Jelly. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh. Okay, that that's starting to make a lot more sense now. Yeah, yeah, I know, right? She's good at this stuff. But look at the roads. Look at the roads. The road building competition yes. is well underway. Azuma's been a busy bee over there. He's creating some kind of moon base. Ooh, nice. And false yes. and Cleo I, over in the over I, yonder. This is you really deliver. You promised beautification and surely it's happening. Overnight, this area was transformed to green. And you know what? If anybody was dissatisfied with the diamond usage in the trees, well, they were quickly forgotten of their troubles with the diamonds with the beautiful green grass. Distracting. Very That's right. wise. That's wow. called next level well, mareship. Distract and beautifying all at once. I, I, I think that's wonderful. So we need to judge them. So once this is all done, we need to judge them. And then whoever wins gets all the diamonds from the road passes. But we need them actually oh, we're to We're judging the, the road. roads. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that. Well, it's, it's okay. you, me, and we need another person. Jelly just isn't going to be able to judge. She's a temporary placeholder. This is once holder. again. Yeah, that's true. But you are that once surely showing your bipartisanship, mm. how kind and, and getting a third unbiased person in here is such a wise, wise idea. Once again, oh. do you have any you don't have any people in mind or are we just going to go? We'll go uh, f find people. I have nobody in mind. We're going to have to find someone. It's it's uh -oh. almost nighttime. So good meeting, gotcha. B-Dubs. I'm going to I'm going to leave you to sleep. And I must Thank be you off. So much. Goodbye, Off you go. Goodbye. Goodbye. I'm going right back to my throne.
good meeting with B-dubs as always, and I have now the sign for the enforcer up on the jobs board. Town hall job. The office of the mayor is in need of an enforcer. If you think you have what it takes, contact Mayor Scar. So the idea behind the enforcer is to, well, get us diamonds for enforcing the different rules that we will enact for the shopping district. Like some shops do not have, and I mean do not have ender chests in them, which is a shock, and also the barge, the court shop, have still yet to pay their road access fee. Some people have been asking why the videos have been a little late recently. It's mainly the fact that I bite off more than I can chew in terms of digging out massive holes and doing it again or, you know, ripping out all the mycelium. Like some of these things take a really, really long time. And then this week I had to make my first trips out of the house to go to the hospital for procedures to have tubes removed and put back in. It was a whole thing. But um, hopefully in the next week or so, we'll start to kind of get back into a rhythm again. Maybe one, two videos regularly every week. Get back to live streams on the weekend which would be really nice. But I thank you so much for the understanding about why videos have been a little late recently, but I hope it makes it up in terms of the quality. We've really done some big things lately. And I just, once again, just thank you for understanding and being so nice in the comments. Like that just means an absolute ton. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching today. I hope you enjoyed. And until next time, this has been Good Times with Scar and I always really appreciate you guys taking the time to watch the videos. If you believe the videos are the rating, that would be much appreciated. And until next time, we'll see you later. And don't forget to subscribe because you may just become scarred for life. Out.